Welcome back to Jewel Sports Cards. Right now, I'm going to predict the future that Sabrina Ionescu is going to beat Steph Curry tonight in the three-point challenge that is happening on NBA All-Star Weekend. To prove time, 6.46 p.m. Central on February 17th. I'm going to upload this video right away so that it even beats the start of the contest. And I have so much faith that I thought this was going to happen, not just today, but earlier in the week because I was looking around and I was going to say this just seems like a moment that people are sleeping on that could be iconic if she beats Steph in the contest right after the NBA's three-point contest that it will be something that social media loses their mind over I would imagine and with that we already have the Caitlin Clark of it all kind of women's sports cards revolution that is kind of anti I'm anticipating only getting bigger and bigger and so I thought to myself let me get a card and just test the theory now she could lose that is a possibility I'm making this without knowing but even if she does I can see that her stardom is just around the river bend shout out Pocahontas and I wanted to try to get a card before I think the hype is going to happen. Now, this is not a pump and dump because not enough people watch my channel to care about what I think. Um, but I want to say that this card that I'm going to reveal is one that I feel very confidently is going to go up in value. I bought it with my birthday money. That's how confident I was. Um, we got a couple of uh, things right there. And uh, let's get the reveal right there. Now, this is the Goodwin Champions. It is not an officially licensed card. And it doesn't feel like the pajama cards that Panini offers us when they do their version of not officially licensed. And I think this is important for a couple reasons. Number one, right now, how many of you that are watching this can name the team that Sabrina Ionescu plays for in the WNBA? I hope more as you continue to participate in the hobby and in um, the sport of basketball. She plays for the New York Liberty. And I think that with women's basketball, so much of it is more driven by the women themselves. I mean, the Instagram followers are incredible in their spheres. And so for her, it's less of the like, oh, I follow the New York Liberty. And there's going to be fans of Sabrina. And if she does beat Steph, tonight it's only gonna happen more right because steph is so beloved so iconic he would handle the moment well and she would just be risen to the stage in a way that uh, national media would have to acknowledge like i can see first take talking about this on monday because it would be such a talking point um and so sabrina's stardom i think is going up now i didn't get this numbered there are numbered parallels of this um, but i just went with the standard one and even if she doesn't win and this isn't a flip moment for me i would still be happy to have this card i think it's awesome and it gives me a little bit more of a connection to the WNBA, which is something i'm continually trying to do i'm actually going to start a four team WNBA fantasy league with my friends and i'm really excited about this summer um, because that's something that get you more invested in the league and i just see the potential and the enjoyment for myself there and so i'm hoping that tonight sabrina really launches the conversation just like caitlin clark has been doing especially as she just broke the record for all-time scoring um it's just an exciting time in the hobby i can i can sense the positivity the negativity of 2022 and 2023 are behind us. This is a new year, new me, and I'm trying to start a little bit more of a unique PC. Now, I will happily flip this card into something that is more valuable in terms of uh, money, if that's what it's going to be. Um, no problem at all, but this was just a, a clear start for me. Of it. I just really like the card. I think Goodwin Champs does well when they have them in street clothes, right? And Panini could definitely learn not to just airbrush the logos out because um, this looks a lot better than that so let's see if i'm right either way this video is going to be up in the comment section you can make fun of me or say yo joel you see it dude you're on a different wavelength and i'll be like yeah because i bought this card and got it shipped to me before then um and i'm very happy about it so let me know what your thoughts are if you have more interest in the WNBA, what your favorite part of the WN, nope, NBA All-Star Weekend is. And uh, as always, y'all, keep just enjoying this hobby. Keep ripping. 
and I'll see you next time on Jewel Sports Cards. Peace.